the Paul Hemmerfire Health Sciences Library, and the Walter G. Ross Hall of the George Washington University Medical Center were dedicated on May 24, 1973. Among the participants of the dedication event were former president of the university, Lloyd H. Elliott, former vice president for medical affairs, James Joseph Pfeffer, and former secretary of health, education, and welfare, Casper W. Weinberger. Secretary Weinberger delivered the dedication address in Listener Auditorium. In his speech, he stated that the provision of quality health care on an equitable basis to all Americans is our number one priority. And clearly, that also involves corrective action to meet the fantastically rapid rise in the cost of health care. A mile away from its previous location, the new building was now united with the rest of the medical center. At a cost of $25.5 million, the new structure was designed to provide modern teaching and research facilities directly across the street from the university hospital. The former 71-year-old structure at 1337 H Street was said to be a miserable educational environment. Dr. Pfeffer said, We literally didn't have a library in the old school. However, there was a small and cramped library with very limited staff and resources inside the medical school on H Street. Federal Health Facilities Grants funded the new center with $10 million. The balance of the cost was funded by private donors. One donor handling the bulk of the construction funds was a self-taught immigrant from Russia named Paul H. Himmelfarb. 